Hey everybody, my name is Tyler Watson, your Las Vegas and Henderson Realtor. This is Tour Time with Tyler, and welcome to Terra Luna. Let's check out this model. So we are over here in South Summerlin today. This is the plan for, it's 3,265 square feet, four or five beds, three and a half to four and a half bathrooms. And this home starts at $1,070,062. Now, if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. I do tours almost daily. And as always, if you could do me a huge favor, please hit that like button. Let's get into this tour. So coming in. Now, I saw these models about a year ago. This is one of my favorites. We'll go through everything so you can see everything. We'll go out back even, the back door is unlocked. We were measuring pools for a different client. But let's actually start by going upstairs. So, coming up, again, upgrades all around. They did the flooring, they did the carpet, but you come on up. So, coming down this awesome hall, again, check out this railing. So, let's come on down all the way through and work our way back. So, if we go all the way over here, we have the first bedroom. Now, decent size. It's probably 11 by 11, maybe a little bit bigger. Again, that's a full-size bed. It has two nightstands, really nice walk-in closet. Snowboarder, this would be my room. Nice size dresser. So it's a good size room. I love what they did with all of the darker trim. Nice size walk-in closet. Right here, we have the next bedroom. And check out the crown molding in this room. This is a big room. I don't know if you can tell, it has a nightstand, a desk, and a big dresser. They even have a coat hanger. This is probably 12 by 13 maybe, maybe even a little bit bigger. Two big windows, but this is a very healthy size room. Again, I love this crown molding up at the top. Two door standard closet but they did do all the shelving already again that is not standard and then into the upstairs bathroom very very nice so whatever you spec for your kitchen cabinets will be the same that you get upstairs and in all the rest of the bathrooms soft closing drawers expected really nice undermounted sinks toilet and a shower now this is pretty cool I know on the camera, it's almost looking like you're in the military with the camo. It does not look that crazy, I promise you in person. The camera is playing tricks on you right now. Really nice vanity. I like the stonework they use. They are the higher countertops. This is your access point. Right here, it's locked. I'm guessing this is for lawn, uh, linens, but right now they're probably using it for something else. Right here at the top, we have a very nice loft. Again, crown molding, really like the ceiling fans. It's like a airplane propeller. You have your outdoor patio balcony. And if we uh, keep swinging around, they went with the wet bar. Again, optional. They installed the fridge for your wine and beer. They have the little sink. But check out this balcony right here. We're right across the street from Cheryl Berkeley School, the elementary school right here in Summerlin. But again, very nice size. This is probably 16 by 12, 13. It's big, maybe even a little bit bigger. I don't have my measure with me. And right here, we come into this room. Now, I just want you to see something, how crazy this model is. These ceilings are nine feet tall. When you walk into this room, it's vaulted and it is probably 13 or 14 feet, maybe even higher over there. This room is very, very spacious. So let me just turn you around. This is a junior suite. It even has an ensuite bathroom, huge window. You're right across the street from the school. Right here we have an upgraded two door sliding closet into, check out this ensuite bathroom. 
This is nicer than some master bathrooms. Huge vanity. <laughs> this is amazing. Let's just check always. So they are very whisper quiet. Nice countertops. Look at this flooring. I don't know if it's coming up in the camera, but it's this herringbone mosaic. It is really neat. You have your toilet and you have a tiled tub shower combo. This is not fiberglass. Look how high up that rod is. This bathroom is huge. And again, just so you can see how high these ceilings are in this room, this is a very nice room. So as always, please like, share, subscribe. Again, hit that like button, it really helps me out. If you have any questions at all, all of my contact info is down in the description. Reach out to me, I'd love to help you in any way possible. Now, I'm gonna give you a quick pan just so you can kind of get a little tease of what this looks like. But let's check out the rest of the house first. So right here, right by the front door, we have our powder room. Love this sink. Again, sink cabinets, you have your toilet. They did wallpaper all around and with that amazing crown molding, really like that. If we come right here, we have the last bedroom. What's nice about this is it's a suite. So we'll check out the bathroom here in a second, but if you have someone who can't go up and down stairs, you want a guest room where people aren't tromping up and down the stairs, this has it right here. So again, two door sliding closet, but it has a three quarter bath en suite. So you have your vanity, toilet, really like this mosaic. Again, it is a hexagon. It's actually stone. It's not just that fiberglass stuff. Big window, very, very nice. Coming straight across, we have our coat closet, Harry Potter room, storage. It's a decent size. Again, it's not going all the way under the stairs because of how much money they put into them. So you lose that for the aesthetic reasons. Your laundry room is downstairs, washer, dryer. They have the sink, they backsplashed it, and the upper cabinets. It's a good sized laundry room actually. This is actually a very nice sink for a laundry room. This is nicer than some kitchens have. And if we come on out, so here you have more storage actual coat closet with the rod. This is your two car garage. There is a third car on the outside. You just can't access it from inside the house. But check this out. Very nice kitchen. So let's start right here. They went with the GE refrigerator standard more compared to those built-in ones. Just because they have the pool, they have so much other options into it. They did the double stack height cabinets. Really like this. Here's your little espresso area. You have microwave and your oven. I'm sure a lot of people would like to see the double oven. Really nice pantry. And it even goes back and around. Let me swing out just so you can see this whole area. I love the box beam look on the ceiling. Let me know, is that your style? Would you like that? Would you rather just be cleaner? Always curious to see what people have to say. Check this out, they did two-tone on the countertops. They did that swirl quartz and a more gray quartz. Look how many cabinets you have. So it helps because up top they just did the shelves. Let me know again, do you like the shelves? Would you rather actually see cabinetry? Always curious. We have our huge GE vent hood and we have a five burner range. We swing right across. You have your dishwasher and a very nice large apron sink. Again, this is what you'd be seeing when you're doing dishes, all that good stuff. Very nice. These ones are always hilarious. So it's maybe five inches wide. Interesting look. We get this view so you can see it. Again, very nice. They have the bar stools, they have their dining area and their living area. Now let's go check what's over here. I actually haven't even walked the property in a year. 
So it's been a while since I've seen this one. You know what? I obviously didn't remember it too well. So here we have our AV, the brains of the whole entire house. The master is downstairs. This is more like it. You have these high ceilings again. Oh, this is even awesome. What's right here? They have nice size walk-in closet. This makes more sense compared to that upstairs one. Again, I am just seeing it for the first time in a year. Let's come on into this master bathroom. And it has a second closet, that's right. Now, let me know what you think. Would you like to have this tub and shower? Would you have this massive shower? What's cool about this is it's actually curbless. There's no curb. You just walk straight in and it has the hidden drain. They have a little bench over there. Right here, we have our toilet and double vanity and another closet. This makes more sense. This is nice and it doesn't go behind, but very, very nice size master bedroom. So that upstairs bedroom is very nice for whoever gets that one, it's large. I'm gonna go ahead and take you, oh, didn't show you this whole room, just so you can see it. I'm gonna go ahead and take you on back Let's go take a look at this. Because it is unlocked. So, covered patio. It does have two pre-wired spots for your ceiling fans if you like to put that. And it has this really cool hidden edge pool. So there's a little tiny sitting area right here where the water's coming up. You get all the fountains out back. And then this pool is about 27 feet long with the infinity edge all the way around the jacuzzi. So there are no edges on this pool. It literally just drains right into the concrete. Pretty neat house. Now, as always, thanks again for tagging along with Tour Time with Tyler. If you have any questions, all of my info is down in the description below. I hope you enjoyed this one. Stay safe out there, everyone.